You can usually spot the bumblebee family from almost anywhere inside Balloon Fiesta Park. If you don't, just listen for the crowd. We take off in the roar of the crowd that we get from the people here in Albuquerque is some of the amazing. Michael Glenn pilots the smallest bee, and he tells us the yellow and black striped trio isn't the only family out on the field. My brother's actually flying one of the, the big bees. He's flying Joey. Michael's dad has been flying balloons for more than 40 years, and Michael always knew he wanted to follow in his father's footsteps. It turns us all into that kid when we see these big, beautiful, colorful things in the sky. And then something tragic. Tragic happened. I was in a, involved in a single car rollover at 21 years old down in Roswell, New Mexico, uh, 19 years ago. That left me paralyzed from the waist down. Michael didn't let that stand in the way of his dream. In 2006, he became the first man in the world to fly a hot air balloon in a wheelchair. Michael sits in these seats, laying on the ground. Once the balloon starts to inflate, the seat is lifted and ready for takeoff. Michael says the FAA initially denied his application, but he fought it and won. Now he hopes his story inspires others. But that's the biggest story I try to say is you can achieve anything you want. Whether they have a disability or not. Sandra Ramirez, KOAT, Action 7 News.